Sean Star and welcome to my channel, Starlight Starbright 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, welcome. Come on in. So today is a very windy day. Like I mentioned yesterday, <laughs> we're going to get the wind starting today. So if you do hear uh, winds in the background, my apologies. If the camera shakes, my apologies. And I've also got a fan running. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I do have a big window back here, which you can every once in a while hear the wind kind of blowing through it. And that's just part of RV life here. But anyway, so I just want to thank everybody for their lovely comments yesterday. And uh, again, I'm just very blessed that each and every one of you um, that are watching, and if you're not, even a part of this RV family. Uh, if you would like to be part of the RV family, though, all you need to do is hit that subscribe button. Uh, please give me a thumbs up because that really, really helps. And... Uh, like I said, I love reading your comments. Absolutely love it. I did try to keep up yesterday, <laughs> on and off. So uh, again, thank you very, very much. Um, my shout out today, as I'm doing, it is Mother's Week. Um, so I am going to shout out this mom. She is uh, just a true blessing. Her name is just Killy. She saved two small little kittens. Uh, I think they're probably about four weeks old now, but she's been showing them on her videos. And she's been having to feed them uh, constantly, probably, what, every three, four hours. And uh, she also has another cat named Chloe, and she has a dog named Elijah. Uh, but she loves to diamond paint. And she is in, I think, almost all the events. And she's, like I said, she's just a real blessing. So go over there to her channel, please. Uh, go give her a subscribe and um, here <laughs> go give her a subscribe and uh, and give her some likes on some of her videos like I said uh, I just absolutely love to listen to her jibber jabber <laughs> as I diamond paint and uh, she always puts a smile on my face so thank you so much you guys I so appreciate it I'll put her channel in my description for you and so it's easy to get at, so you just click on it, go over there, hit the subscribe, and let's just give her some love. Yay! So, so yeah. So that's my shout out for uh, mothers this week. Uh, and I do know that I I did say mothers, mothers and daughters, but uh, she's a new mom. <laughs> And she's got uh, she's got two little kitties that uh, she has taken in that are her new daughters. Actually, one's a one's a female, one's a male. So, a daughter and a son. But yeah. So I just wanted to uh, share her channel today. All right. So I got everything set up here on the table, and we are going to get at this. Oh my goodness! I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm not a crafter, so if I make any boo-boos along the way, yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> so anyway, so I'm going to move the camera down, and then we will get started. All right. Okay, I think we're good. So the first thing I wanted to show you is I have this glue gun here, and I got this off of Timu last, last summer. And it came with this little gun here, and then it came with all these glue sticks. And this nice little container. So this did come off of Timu. Um, I am an influencer with Timu, so if I will put up a code on the screen. If, I, if you are new, or if you haven't uh, downloaded the app yet, just go into my description. There will be a link there for you. And then uh, you just click on the link. Uh, Timu gives you one hour to shop, and then from there you get uh, 30 to, or when you do the checkout and you use my code, uh, Timu will give you 30% off your first order, as, all, as well as those that reinstall Timu. So if you haven't had Timu on your phone for the past 14 days, and you reinstall it, same thing, you use that link, you use the code, and it will give you 30% off. And anybody can use that code, and it... And if you use that code, it really helps me uh, for seeding money that I can share more products with you to review. So that's how Timu works. <laughs> Timu is awesome. I absolutely love Timu. Everything you see here it actually comes from Timu. 
believe it or not, everything. So, oh, well, except for this map. My little chef here, that's my husband. And yeah, he didn't come from Timu. <laughs> Just kidding. But yeah, um, but everything else, yes, basically came from Timu. So, let's get the uh, ball rolling here. I'm going to turn on my my hot glue gun. I just wanted to show you these butterflies. Uh, these are what I hauled the other day. I did the butterfly. Um, I showed you the butterfly keychains. So they are double sided. So they so you do it on both sides, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. And I'm gonna be putting some of these in my giveaways. And so I was working on them last night. So I got the one sided one side done anyway on the rest of these so today I'm going to work on the other side really really pretty yeah I didn't do my nails today because I figured I'm working with glue and everything else so that I would just not even bother <laughs> so yeah they're really really pretty really like them I just also want to thank everybody that has used my code uh, it has helped, and um, I'm really reaching for the goal to get $60 this month of CD money from Timu, uh, so I can review more products with you guys, and yeah, that's my goal. So these are my coasters here that I plan on doing, so I'm going to lay them down like this, kind of, and I'm going to put the string, I got the string here, I got a little bow here, and so that's a plan for those. So, and these coasters as well came from Timu. So, if they turn out really good, I, I might uh, make more. But in the meantime, I got these cute little, um, whatchamacallit, magnets. See how tiny they are? Just tiny, tiny. But I'm going to put a magnet on the back of these uh, little uh, things I picked up yesterday on that uh, pin. And I'm going to make little cover minders. So, now they do, will have a hole on the top, of course, so you could put a piece of string or whatever and hang them up when you're not using them. I think that's a good idea. And then I have these two little characters here, and they are on both sides. But you can see one side is dull and one side is shiny. So on the dull side, I'm going to put these bigger magnets on. So while the glue gun is heating up, let's do this first. and hopefully there we go so they these magnets also come from Timu but they do have a backing on them so I'm just going to try to get this as in the middle as possible just press down and then I'm just gonna leave this one on top because we don't need that so we don't need sticky now this one doesn't stick as, or these these ones don't stick together as well. So I don't know. Let's let's see how it works on a piece of paper here. So say I want to fold this back. I'm gonna hold use this as my cover minder. Yeah. I guess it does hold. Oh yeah. See, look at that. Pick it up and everything. So yeah. So there's one done. I thought that was just going to be a really cute for a little cover minder. What do you guys think? Let me know. <laughs> what do you think? Anyway, I think that's really, really cute. And then I have to make sure that I don't put this on the shiny side. And then we'll do the next one. But yeah, I noticed that these magnets weren't as strong as... Uh, those little those little ones there but because these are bigger I'm hoping that that these will all stay together oh yeah I'm not, I'm not gonna op I'm not going to undo that one so there we go this this one seems stronger than the other one definitely stronger so you want to keep this cover on because it is sticky and but yeah so there's the other one so yay, we got one project done. <laughs> so yeah, let me know what you think of those. Now, we got these little guys here. And then we got my little... So I'm not sure. 
I'm going to just take two off. I think they, they'll work well. What do you guys think? Just a matter of picking it up and just making a, a small little glue. This is what scares me because I know this glue is hot. So I'm going to just see if I can... Oh, this got wrapped around here. Let's get this so it's not wrapped around. Oh, dear. Okay, there we go. All right. So I'm just going to make a small little... this press it down hopefully it's straight so there we go <laughs> so I just thought these would be good for like if you're doing like a 20 by 20 painting or something and uh Hopefully that sticks on there. Okay, so that didn't stick. So let's try again. Whoops. Alright, so maybe this isn't the glue for this. I don't know. I have to use, like, super glue. If this doesn't work, then I'll get out my super glue and try that. I thought the glue gun was was supposed to stick everything, but maybe not. Or maybe we'll just let that dry and see what happens. Now we'll do the next one. So these are very, very strong uh, little magnets. It's like, oh my goodness. I wonder though. I think I should do the bigger magnets. Let me just see. Where's my bigger magnets? No, these ones are too big. Yeah, that would cover up the whole thing. Okay, so we're just going to use the tiny magnets. Oh my goodness, the wind. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Uh, my goodness. So, if you live in Oklahoma up to Wichita, Kansas today, there is going to be some severe storms. Um... So please keep uh, your alerts on and so forth if you're in those areas. Um, Ryan Hollyall is going to be on later on today and there will be a bunch of storm chasers out there. So uh, if you can, turn him on YouTube and, and he will tell you exactly where these, uh, if any tornadoes will touch down or where the bad storms are. Um, he's so good with his information. And so, yeah, so, what does he always say? Be, don't be scared, be prepared. And, um, yes. Please be prepared out there today, guys. There's something like a 30% chance today. It's just incredibly high. And, uh, I just want to have everybody out there stay safe. And... If you have storm shelters, get into your storm shelter. If you don't have a storm shelter, then they say to uh, get into the interior of your house where there's no windows and cover yourself up with a mattress or make sure you have good shoes on your feet just in case. So yeah, just be prepared guys. I love you all and I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Alrighty. That is done. So we got the cover minders done. Now for the fun project. So, I, like I said, I got these little bows and we are going to do some painting. So, I got this little tray here. I got lots of these trays. <laughs> this is the food I feed my puppies. Come out of these little trays here. And they eat soft and they eat kibble. So I thought I would do one pink and one purple for Eeyore. Eeyore's tail. Oh, 
and see how it turns out. Now this is just acrylic paint and I got this again off of Timu. Like I said, uh, I got all my stuff here today. Even my brushes come off of Timu. So Timu has a lot of different uh, items that you can shop for. Because um, they have like thousands of sellers on there. And yeah. Make sure you shop around on there though. Um, because if one seller is selling a product, chances are somebody else's as well. So, and you want to, of course, get your best price in town. And you can actually, if you um, look at your item and you click on your picture and it will get into a bigger uh, picture thing, then, um, then you can actually hit the camera part. And there's a little camera in the corner of your phone. Oops. And then uh, from there, you can see all the other sellers that are... Oh, this one's probably not even open yet. Yeah, so i got to take this off. Anyway, there's a little camera in the corner of your phone, like in the uh, when you're in the app. And you click on that camera and it scans it and then it will show... Um, if any other seller is selling the same uh, product, product and so yeah so shop around if you can unless you're on the one hour time limit then just kind of know ahead of time I would suggest even if you have a computer or laptop just check out Timu if you haven't already and uh, just see what's out there for their products um, like don't make an account or anything. Just, just search, Just go look at Timu. You can also, you know, compare prices if you want. So compare prices to other online stores, and I'm sure you'll find that Timu does have really, really good prices uh, for their items. You do have to be watch out though because um, Timu is starting to get warehouses here in the states. And I'm not sure if it's in other countries as well, but I just know here in the States. And uh, they do charge a uh, shipping fee unless you purchase a s so much. Uh, for example, this one company I was looking at charges $30. Or you have to purchase $30 worth of stuff in order to get free shipping. But that's almost like any company, really. Even Timu, you have to purchase a certain amount to get... Uh, the shipping so it's just the way it is so there's a cute little bows what do you guys think I think they turned out really really cute put this over here so I don't knock that over because knowing me put the brush here and yeah all right so now we're gonna take oh I should let these dry over here <laughs> I'm not knocking into them there we go okay so now we're gonna take I got the backings and then we're going to take this here and we want it probably about like this I would think. Move these out of the way for now and I'm going to flip this these over here and then I got my twine here and then I want at least a little bit hanging down. So, see if I can make it same on each side. So then they're going to be glued like this. Okay. All right. Let's try this. So I think I just want to put a little... Oh, dear. I think I just want to put a little piece of glue down here. And do one here. And one here. I hope this is all I need for gluing this. At least just to hold it down. And then one here. That at the bottom. Oh, 
Hopefully that's enough at the top. What do you think? Or do you think I should move it up a little bit? Maybe I should move it up a little bit. If I can take this off. Well, this one is going to be like this. <laughs> We're going to move up the other one a little bit. So, boat. Right there. And I want them even. Hopefully it'll go straight. I think these are going to end up being so crooked. But that's okay. This is going to be the first one. And you know what? It, I don't think it matters. This is totally made with love. <laughs> and uh, I still think it's going to turn out really, really cute. At the very end. There's my two, and then we're going to do this one here on top. Now we're going to do a little here. Okay. Oops, I got a little bit too much glue there. That's okay. Let's do a little here. And then. This one here. Like so. That is hot glue. I know Timu sells these rubber things you can put on your fingers when you're using this glue. Which would probably be a good idea. But, you know. And look at that. <laughs> okay, so they hang, and then I'm going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these little boards here, and I have this glue here, and I'm just going to go around the edges here. I'm going to just go all over. Oh, there's my Ollie. It's okay, Ollie. The neighbor's leaving and he can hear the truck, so he's got to bark. Say, Mom, there's somebody outside. Make a noise. I'm just going to glue this down. Hopefully that works. And maybe I'll just have to put a piece of, a little bit of glue here, too. Just to hold this in the corners. Probably better, yeah. This works good, actually. I might just use this, the glue gun. There. So there's one. And then I have the shiny so this one will go here yeah this works really really well Oops. glue. No, I need another stick. I thought I took out another stick. Maybe not. Oops. Oh dear. 
That's all right. I have to cut that off a little bit there. It's a little bit uneven on the top one there. But there. So we got the three, three Eeyores there. Look at that. That is so cute. And then I'm just going to crisscross this at the bottom. And where did I put my... I need another one of these glue sticks here. Let's pull that out. I figured just crisscross it here at the bottom and then like so and then we will put the pink one right there at the bottom. And it's still a little bit wet. And there we are. It is a little bit. Hopefully it all sticks together there. Got glue all over the place. Oh well. Alright guys. There it is. What do you think? I think I need to give this one a, one more little bit of coating of of uh, pink here. Nice, nice and pink. There we go. And there it is. So these ones here I'm going to cut at an angle. I might have to uh, burn the ends of this or something though. Because it might fray. I don't know how that works. This one is a little bit longer. I'm going to Let's do this and make sure that they're cut the same. There we go. And there it is. So cute. So that's one done. And there you go. There you guys go. What do you think? I don't know if I can get them all in here. Maybe if I move up the camera a little bit or move it away. And move him. And then you got his tail there at the very end. <laughs> I think that's cute. And then hang him up on the wall. Yeah. I think that's really, really cute. So we'll just let that dry, and then that one's done. So we'll move that out of the way, put it down here, and then we'll get on to the next one. Actually, it's already been 30 minutes. <laughs> so I will get this one done, and then I will show you the finished product afterwards. I'll hang them somewhere here on, somewhere on my wall here, just to show you what it looks like hanging up. And, uh, yeah, so thank you so much. Oh, hold on. Let me just move this up. Hopefully it will work. 
All right, guys, that was my project for today, and I had so much fun doing it. I think everything worked out really, really well. Um, this is going to also be part of my giveaway uh, when I have everything together and set up, along with the pretty butterflies here. Um, and of course, it's going to be my beautiful um, uh, butterfly fairy. So, yeah, really looking. Uh, Forward. I want to get the trim put on her which with the washi tape so once I get everything set up which will probably be sometime later this week then we will go through that and we will start the giveaway so anyway the Sun is just barely starting to come into the window here it we have our truck parked out there so it kind of glares off the truck and then into the trailer here so Alrighty guys, that is my creation for today. Thank you so much for joining me. And again, if you like what you saw, uh, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. I would love to have you here. And uh, leave me a comment. Yeah, let me know. How do you think that turned out? <laughs> like I said, I'm not really a crafter, so this was a lot of fun though. I really enjoyed it. And uh, from my home to yours, I wish you a wonderful, wonderful day. And it'll probably be afternoon by the time you see this, but that's okay. So have a wonderful afternoon, evening, night, wherever you are. And of course, God's richest blessings. And I'll catch you on the next one.